see now this is mum's motherboard right here I'm gonna zoom out a little bit so you can see better I don't know if this is gonna come in blurry or not there we go see those two capacitors right there with the Sharpies, I'm going to point it out. There's one right there. They're bulged on the top, see? That's no good. Also that one. This one right here. There's another one over here, close to the processor. There's seven of them on the board that are blown. Now this big thing here is called a heat sink. And underneath is the Northbridge chipset. And if it overheats, you're going to have a problem, and it won't boot up. And that's the problem she was having, because over here is supposed to be an anchor through the board, so that this clip right there can hook onto it and secure the whole heat sink just like this one here you see how it's clipped on there well that anchor right here didn't exist over there it was never there so the heat could not dissipate too good and I'm surprised she didn't have a problem a long time ago with it well I brought it to the wholesale computer supply store to look for an anchor and they said I wouldn't be able to fix it well, as you can see, I did, because I went by work and got some aviation bus wire and soldered it through that hole to create an anchor. And as you can see, you can't budge it. It's, it's, it's tight. So that's good. I just hope we saved the chipset from burning out. All right, well, that concludes today's lesson about motherboards. And my kitchen table is turning into a, a workstation. There's Roscoe. He's guarding a couple of power supply boards I've got to do for some TVs. Take a look at these. Yeah, there's a short on there. That's going to be fun to find somewhere. Uh, well, that's it.